Hey everybody, welcome back. This is a video we did in Elizabethan, Tennessee. I was actually, I said we, but I was by myself. Uh, I had to run into town early there Wednesday morning, yesterday morning, and videoed this of what is called the covered bridge. You can no longer drive cars across it, but you used to be able to. Uh, it is now part of the park there in Elizabeth and right behind the courthouse. Um, and I decided it was a pretty day. Why not get some good footage of the covered bridge and surrounding little waterfall? So here's what you've got here. Uh, actually, a part way into this video, I find a snake over right next to where I'm standing on a concrete platform to the right of this uh, image here. Um, I fly the drone around to it here in just a minute so you can actually see it. I didn't notice it at first, and then when I did notice it, I thought it was dead, and I fly the drone over to it to video from over top of it of the snake. I was standing down next to them red poles right there on the outside of that little boxed-in area, and uh, I thought, you know, it's a dead snake. I'll get close to it and see what kind it is. Um, this was after I had already been standing within a foot away from it and walked away. Came back to it once I saw it after I'd walked away. And uh, come to find out it wasn't dead. I'm not sure what kind of snake it was. I haven't looked it up yet, but it didn't get bit, so I wasn't real worried about it. But that comes up later on in the video. I don't know how I didn't get bit, but it didn't. I ended up, I guess, scaring him more than he scared me when I went back over to inspect him because I thought he was dead. He jumped into the water, which is frigid cold, so I'm sure that was the shock of his life. And uh, he swam back over to the rock wall next to where I was standing and climbed back up on the rocks to do some more sunbathing and probably to de-thaw because I'm sure he was pretty cold. That is Main Street Bridge in Elizabethan. That is right next to the big roundabout. Here we are getting closer to the bridge. I don't know what happened to the footage right there. That is so crazy. This is from up above in Elizabethan. My cat is playing with bubble wrap behind me. She is having a blast with it. So I figure let her go. There's that platform, and to the right of the screen, well, I turned too fast. Covered bridge needs a new roof. And you can see some ducks over there. I think it's a pretty little man-made waterfall. You see here, I'm, the drone is right above that snake. There he is. Center of the screen, curled there almost in half. This is after I had saw him and I was trying to get the drone over close to him without hitting those bars. He never moves, even with the wind off of the drone. At one point, leaves fly over top of him from the wind of the drone. He never moves. I thought he was dead. In this shot, you can see he's still standing there. And in between these two shots, I pause for a minute and walk over to him. And that's when he jumps at me and then jumps into the water. That's when I realized he was playing possum with me. But 
He was probably a harmless snake. I haven't looked him up yet. I think he panicked more than wanted to hurt anything. That's neat the way that wave is made right there. There's my red truck in the background. Hidden behind the pine tree. I figured I would get fussed at for flying here this early in the morning. But I had several police officers drive by and never said a word to me. Of course, right on the left-hand side of this covered bridge is the jailhouse and courthouse. So, if they were going to fuss at me, it wouldn't have taken them long to get there. Right over there behind those buildings is the courthouse and all. Old downtown Elizabethan. That's where they have their Saturday night car meets. It's down the main strip right there. It's neat how if you look around, I never realized it before, but all of Elizabethan is in this little valley. With mountains on all sides. Coming up next, I went to Warrior's Path just to take the kids, let them play at the park for a little while. And I decided to get in one more real quick flight. But we took the kids over to the park to play, so. I figured while they're playing on the playground right behind me there, why not go for a little fly? There was a lot of interference. Um, this is the Phantom 3, which is basically my backup for doing aerial photography. Uh, I typically use the Phantom 4 Pro Plus, but it's had some issues, so I had to send it back to be repaired. Uh, hopefully I'll have it back in the next few days. But either way, I kept getting all kinds of crazy interference with this one, so I didn't take much of a flight. I only had it up for a minute, so I didn't want to end up it crashing. But it was losing signal at really short distance. But, Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. I should have another video up for you all today. I'll see you soon.